least some space over here. I think we should start getting some docks port area over here as well. A quick trader check. No, we don't need any of those, and so I'm gonna knock those off. Just bring us whatever. A few got still in there, go away. Uh, leather, do we need leather? Yeah, we, we could buy it, couldn't we? It's only 500, so keep everyone happy. What am I taking? Yeah, 1500. Firewood, because herbs are running a bit low. Trade, Smith. Okay, yeah, so. Yeah, we, we're doing things, aren't we? Let's, um, let's see what's going on over here. Yeah, the, the house matches sort of the new medieval towns. Mod houses looks really good. Um, yeah, cheese. It's making cheese. So we need people in there, don't we? Let's put a couple of people in there. We're on 144 people. We're doing well. Our food was around 300. It's coming down. Uh, back to five stars. Health is really good. Um, yeah, everything's everything's sort of on point, really. Looking good. Um, we just need a bit more firewood, and uh, we've just got to keep an eye out on those herbs. Um, so yeah, uh, and again at the start of the last episode, I think we were discussing these little gaps here, and uh, I thought I was going to do something with them. So uh, yeah, let's do that now. I've also cleared this area here, or well, I've tried to, um, and I'm going to flatten it as well. Because really, what I want to do is bring. It doesn't need to be up to there. Yeah, it's just annoying me that this is out <laughs> by a few. Um, and we sort of got a nice clean line going across here, and uh, it's sort of spoiled at the end just by these pastures sort of jutting out a bit further than I'd like them to. It's quite um, OCD, I know, but uh, yeah, we'll just fix it. We'll just bring it into line. We can we can drop these. We've got room to drop these. We can just get rid of these two. Um, on that note, if we're going to move these, let's let's move the blacksmith. Over into this corner here. Uh, we'll stick with Red Ketchup's model because um, you get the extra house, don't you? And I think, yeah, looking at, I was looking this offline. Um, yeah, so we've got 287 families, but only 234 homes. So even though we built all those houses on the other side of the port, we're still sort of down a bit. So it's just in the back of my mind that, you know, we could keep building, building, building houses basically, otherwise I'll, we might get our population uh, dropping again. So, yeah. Anyway, let's get this um, blacksmith re, uh, rehoused over this size. Um, yeah, throw him down, get his house placed on top. Now, uh, yeah, we've got this red brick down here, I think I'm going to remove that. And then stick with this sort of pebble effect up to about uh, up to here, so all the nomad villages got the same floor cover. Um, yeah, because can't start doing stuff out here, couldn't we? Let's throw a trader in. Uh, dun, 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 dun. If we can find one standard trader. It's not less about. And, I like to push these as far back as they can go because the river's not very wide and you, you get a load of boats coming up and they sort of just clip through your models so if you can push them back as far as they'll go but I don't want to block this entrance either so right to the back how far across can we get it well we're, yeah well yep yeah, there it is then okay so let's let that build um, let's maybe give a bit of an anchor point um, all buildings. Do I want to do that? No, let's not do that just yet. Um, yeah, because I don't want the buildings too close up to the wall. I do like having like a line of separation. Um, yeah, but we could fill in this bit here. Get that looking all nice. And uh, yeah, really now we need to you know, destroy stuff, so 
let's mark these two buildings for going. Um, this is flat. Yeah, so the reason I've flattened this off and removed this is, uh, well, A, so we can get cracking and finally put some silk huts in, but also I'm going to need to um, just put in some temporary pastures for these cows. So yeah, let's just throw a few down. Um, we'll mark off where the top should be. And yeah, now we need to get these um, get these two built and then we'll stick all these cows in there, destroy these, move these down, um, put new ones in, cows back over, get rid of these, and then let's get some silkworm huts in finally. So yeah, come on, chop chop. Let's get these uh, let's get these built. Okay. Uh, so while they're doing that, let's um, let's have a little tinker down here. So uh, yeah, we don't have any woodcutters up here, so maybe we should throw in a few woodcutters just across here. Yeah, I'm thinking we can get this guy bringing in iron and coal and logs, and then we can come cut up for firewood here, and then this blacksmith can use them for um, carbon steel tools. Yeah, I fancy making some carbon steel tools, so uh, we've got a trader right here bringing all the supplies in, and, uh, and this guy can make them all. And we've got loads of storage here as well, which is handy. So uh, yeah, let's, um, let's get some houses, let's go for some stone houses, we haven't used any of these. I don't want to use the bigger ones that have come in the fountain mod just yet. Not just here. Maybe. Maybe over here. Um, but, uh, yeah. So. I do quite like this model of Stone House. So let's. Let's throw them in there. Um, I'm going to keep all this area a bit. Um, made of stone, I think. Yeah, I quite like it for the. Sort of docks and port areas, and um, yeah, woodcutters. Hopefully, this will help us to uh, increase this number as well. Because obviously, we don't need fifty thousand logs. So. Um, yeah, let's put a couple in. Let's go mental. Um, in fact, actually, let's need the space in between these two woodcutters for um, yeah. Stop uh, brain freeze them for a minute. Um, yeah, let's get marked out. Um, six by two. I think we just that's all we're going to need. They've got backup here with these ones, and yeah, there's nothing in a lot of them. They've got loads of space. So. Yeah. Okay. And let's let's get these guys a stone house on this side. That's quite a nice model, actually, isn't it? Um, yeah. Let's um, let's be brave and choose that. Okay. The reason I didn't put a line going across there is just because these are quite deep. So I don't want to push further down here. Um, so they can just walk around the front. And uh, yeah, let's wang someone in. How are we getting on over here? Okay, so the tailor and the blacksmith is gone. We're ready to start accepting uh, cows. Uh, let's just take you down. Empty. How many can you fit in? Uh, number 11. So let's get you opened up. Uh, you can empty and you can empty. So, yeah, zero, 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 zero cows. Let's destroy all those. 
and let's get rid of all the road as well. Uh, well, the road in the centre. So yeah, how far do we need to drop? Let's have a look. So one, two, three. Okay. Um, one, two, three. Right. Yeah. Okay. Let's draw you across there. Let's get rid of this gravel. And we'll replace that with brick. And then obviously the this sort of gravel effect and just start from here for the Nomad Village. Um, yeah, well that's all getting done. Uh, what else can we put down here? Uh, yeah, population's growing so we could possibly use another food source. So, well, uh, what about going down to this quayside section? We've got fishermen's dock in here, haven't we? So, um, yeah, we could well, that's annoying. This sort of little line here is part of the model, so we're always going to get a gap. Uh, that's frustrating. Oh well. Okay, well. Um, yeah, let's throw it in anyway. Just avoided being clipped there from this model. Uh, they're going through here though, but there's nothing really much we can do about that. Um, so yeah, we've got a fishery down. Maybe some storage. Yeah, why not? Let's throw it in. We've got a trader here, so having a big storage barn is going to be um, handy, I think. Yep, another wool cutter for you. Um, just, I'd have to wait for these to be built because when you're going on a diagonal down a river, it's hard to know where to position your next models because um, you sort of want them going on a bit of a line. The sort of effect I want to have for this area is just for everything to be fairly crammed in, sort of poor end to town, on, on the outskirts of the wall, a bit higgledy-piggledy, um, quite industrial, you know, maybe a few sort of alleyways and things. So, yeah, it's just going to be a bit of a hodgepodge. I'm just going to keep throwing stuff in, uh, make it look a little... Um, yeah, just a bit of a sort of more crazier design, really. So... Um, yeah, have a couple of fishermen. Now we're getting on up here. Okay, we're cooking with gas up here, so let's um, let's keep forging ahead. And yeah, let's go straight to um, our pastures. Nothing fancy here. We're just going to stick with uh, ten by twenty-five. We're going to move the. Sheds to the back though, leave the space. They turned by 26 out here. Okay, and that really should line up, yeah, with the top. So, my OCD has been appeased. Let's um, fill in the rest of this road. Okay, so that's pretty much done, and um, we'll let these build. And then shunt these guys back over here. And uh, while we're waiting for that, in fact, let's just prioritise that. There's not a huge amount going on um, in between this episode and the last one. I just let uh, it run on a bit. And we got the building items down really low. And the labour rate went up as well. So it's beneficial for us. We can actually get stuff done in each episode. Okay, so we can pretty much judge this now, can't we? Um, yeah, I've got to be careful with this piece. What do I want here? This fairly flat piece. If it's going to be like a dock or a port, we could put a could put a wharf and ship in. Um, yeah, give it that sort of uh, that feel to it. Um, will it go? Oh, just will you get clipped? Oh, it just misses you. Let's throw you in. Wait for you to get built, and then maybe some houses here. For the fishermen, the traders. Uh, what have you brought us? Hemp seeds, cabbage seeds. Um, 
What are you? You're just a seed merchant. I'm gonna ask you to bring tobacco as well. I know we've asked one other guy to do it, but there's a good chance I'll miss him. So we've got a couple of guys bringing it. That'll uh, make it a bit easier. Um, yeah, so firewood's shooting up, 21,000. Herbs are still pretty low, so we're not gonna use herbs. Uh, let's put something different in here. We've got a lot of booze up here. Let's see what we've got. Um, ale, yeah, 1,700. Uh, size spirits. Yeah, we've got nearly 4,000 spirits, so let's... Um, and wine as well. Let's, let's put some firewood in as well. Um, I'll put a thousand in there. And spirits. Let's, uh, how much is that worth? It's going to be 500. What else have we got that's worth a bit of money? Bum, 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 bum. Lamp oil's coming in, but we haven't got a huge amount of it yet. Really, we need the silk, don't we? Um, we're not building supplies and things like that. We're starting to build stuff and hull components. Um, building supplies, 500. Let's put 50 building supplies in. just want to see how much um, they're going to give us. Uh, 50 are you in. What else? Hull components. What are we doing for that? Yeah, have we made any? Oh, we've got 106. Again, let's put 50 in and see what sort of buying power it gives us. Okay. Uh, trade. Yeah, so spirits 12. Um, so how many people put 500? So that's, you know, 5,000 at least there. Building supplies 50, 5 times 35, so 3,500 there. Hull components 50, well. As you can see, that's gonna. This trade is gonna have a lot of buying power. So um, let's take him down to two. Make sure that that's right. Nine of nine. Yep. Okay. So uh, yeah, everything's getting built down here. Really want to get this done. So come on, get it done. Um, let's. Get these set back up to fusion cows. Um, what's that done? 13 of 13, 12 of 13. Okay. How are we getting on here? Oh, so close. Let's check this trader. No. If you got iron stone. No, again. 7,000 stones, really good for that. Yeah, I did buy a bit um, as well, just to top us up, because I knew we were going to be doing a lot of building, so. Okay, burn baby, burn. So we've got some wells in, you see them running to the back alleys to the well. Let's rebuild you, I think it was just one house, wasn't it? So. Yeah. Yeah, it's looking good. Yeah, I think I'm going to shunt those back one. Or am I? I don't know. What happens if we... Put a bit of red round. Maybe. Yeah. Well, yeah, we'll keep tinkering. Um, nope. Go away. Right, come on, cows. Have you built yet? Yeah, you have. That's uh, region cows. Empty. Um, come on, so close. Get it done. So there's four in there, 33, zero in here. So let's destroy this. Uh, so you can't keep going back in there. Uh, four of 13, split. Yeah, 13, 14, 13. Freezing cows, split. 
12 of 13. And they've still got loads of spare, but unfortunately we're just going to have to say goodbye to them. So you can go. Um, yeah, Herzman. We've got three more than we need, so let's take that down. Yeah, CD. Food is dropping a bit. I might, um, I might take that up to four. Just keep the fish coming in. Uh, yeah, we need some more houses, don't we, down here? So, let's see what we can do there. This episode is probably running on a bit longer than I wanted it to, but I just wanted to get those cows shifted. And, and basically, they're going to run this episode until I've got those goddamn silk horses in. <laughs> it's the last thing I do. So, um, yeah. It was a bit harder with the, the quayside buildings because you can sort of overlap each other, so you just got to be wary of that. And we've got that there. I think I'll have just enough room here. Let's uh, throw that one down. Let's see how that looks. We'll come back to it in a minute. Um, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. What else could we throw in here? Yeah, one of the Fountain Mods Inns is a really nice model. Let's have a look. It's a corner aspect as well. Um, it's a bit different. Uh, can't remember what it does. It's either somewhere you can get annihilated or it's like a boarding house. I'm not too sure, but we could, um, you know, we could throw it in. Um, let's, yeah, let's leave a gap at the back. I'll give it a double room. That's sort of triple road, that really, isn't it? But yeah, let's throw that down there. Uh, bit of colouring in, so we can see what we're doing. Let's take a road all the way down here now. Yeah, because I was just wanting to get those wood uh, wood cutters in. Um, yeah, well, let's let that build. Right now, come on. Right, great. So, yeah, last act. I'm putting the silk cuts in, and then we'll come straight back and we'll get this whole area done. Uh, we're going to need another tailor uh, going back in um, because we've destroyed one over here. So, yeah, and we're going to need some houses, I think, over here. And, um, yeah, some tobacco. Let's get some tobacco on the go. It sort of fits in with our booze production over here so anywho silk huts silk huts silk huts where are you there you are and how many can we get down here one two three four start from either side one two three four oh, that's a perfect fit lovely right okay well um, yeah they're in finally uh, only sort of 20 episodes in um, but yeah everyone's happy silk huts are finally in and uh, yeah I'll um, I'll get cracking with this section here in the next video so yeah I'll see you in a bit <laughs>